Hey! Hey! I'm Mr. O, here with another. Oh, wow! Moment at the Children's Museum of Houston. A fan sent me a video they saw on the internet showing a bar of soap getting really big inside a microwave. And she wanted to know if that was real, and if so, why it worked. So first, let's try it, and then see if we can explain why it works. Please remember, microwave ovens are not a toy, so do not do any of the experiments you're about to see at home. We're gonna do it safely here in this old microwave that really isn't used for food anymore. Let's get experimenting. We're gonna make a soap souffle. First, we place some paper towels in the center of the microwave and a bar of ivory soap on top of them. We then turn on the microwave for two minutes. That's it, just watch what happens. So it definitely works, but why and why only with ivory soap? Mostly it comes down to the fact that ivory soap is different from other soaps. Try this. Drop a different brand of soap into the water and it sinks. But a bar of ivory soap floats. Ivory soap floats because it's less dense than normal soap. Most soaps contain the same basic ingredients. The difference that makes ivory soap less dense is that it's a foam. It has air incorporated into it. Think of it like this. This is cream, vanilla, and sugar. If I whisk it just a little, it becomes a sweetened cream. But if I whisk it a lot, air gets mixed into it, creating whipped cream. Whipped cream, a foam, has different properties than sweetened cream because of the air. And the adding of air is why ivory soap has different properties than normal soap. According to legend, the chemist who created ivory soap accidentally left the mixer going while he went to lunch. This incorporated a lot of extra air into ivory soap, making it less dense and therefore floated, unlike the other brands of soap on the market. And the new floating soap was a huge market success. Also, all that air inside the ivory soap is why it expands in a microwave. As the soap is heated by the microwaves, it softens. At the same time, the air in the bubbles is also heated up by the hot soap. When air and other gases get hot, their volume, or how much space they take up, increases. In other words, they expand, and therefore cause the warm soap to spread out. When the microwave stops, the soap cools and stiffens up so it holds it to the new shape. This has been another Oh Wow Moment from the Children's Museum of Houston. We hope your mind can come out to play.